Authorities reveal issue from home at center of deadly Pennsylvania explosion. According to the Allegheny County Fire Marshal's office, the house where the explosion that killed five people and severely damaged several other buildings over the weekend took place had hot water tank issues. Officials issued a statement Monday night advising the public to avoid the plum outside of the Pittsburgh region while they investigated the source of the devastation on Saturday morning. The fire marshal's office can confirm that it is aware that the homeowners at 141 Rustic Ridge Drive were having hot water tank issues. The tank was located in the basement of the home, the fire marshal's office said. Officials will now investigate that information along with any and all other possibilities during their processes that may explain what occurred, it added. Heather Orovitz, 51, the town's director of community development, and Michael Thomas, the borough manager, 57, were both killed in the explosion, according to Plum Mayor Harry Schlegel. Along with three other residents in the area, 38-year-old Casey Klontz, 12-year-old Keegan Klontz, and 55-year-old Kevin Sabunia. Paul Orovitz, the spouse of Orovitz, has significant burns covering the majority of his body and was hospitalized Tuesday, according to Schlegel. Two other victims of the explosion were hospitalized, treated, and then released. A total of three structures were destroyed and at least a dozen more damaged in some way, the Allegheny County government wrote on its Facebook page. According to the government, County 911 received numerous calls from the Rustic Ridge Drive and Brookside Drive area and Plum Borough at approximately 10.22 a.m. reporting a house explosion, several houses on fire and damaged, and reports that people may have been in the impacted homes. First responders from the police and fire department arrived on scene and reported that there were people trapped under debris and that it appeared as if one house had exploded and two others were engulfed in fire, it added. A few homes away resident Rafal Kolonkovsky told the Pittsburgh Post-Gazette that the explosion rocked him and his wife to the ground and smashed the windows in his home. It's just tragic, I mean, it looks like a war zone. It looks like a bomb hit our neighborhood, and it's just unfortunate," Kolonkovsky said. I was just with some of the neighbors yesterday, and now this happens.